I'm Abigail Bone and I'm here outside the Frist Art Museum where just inside culture from around the world comes to life right here in the heart of Nashville. In 2001, the Frist Art Museum opened its doors to the public. However, the building itself has a rich history dating far back past that. We are in Nashville's former main post office, which is a fine example of stripped classicism and art deco architectural styles from the 1930s. When this building ceased serving as the main post office, a community visioning process and later a public-private partnership determined that this building would be um, the perfect place for an art museum. Much more impressive than the history of the building is the art that is on display inside of it. Curator Katie Delmez explained that the goal of the Frist is to showcase a wide variety of art. Our mandate is to show the art of the world, and so certainly we have brought things from, you know, Egypt and France and South America. We we've, we've bring things from all over the world here. While some of the names that are on display here may not be widely known, the Frist has also hosted exhibits showcasing major, major artists such as Frida Kahlo, Van Gogh, and even a ch childhood favorite, Eric We Kahlo. had never done a, a children's illustration show, and it's something that we were definitely interested in, and Eric Carle certainly seemed like the right place to start. He's beloved by everyone, children, adults, you know, grandparents and parents, you know, everybody loves Eric Carle's work. The exhibit features many of Carle's illustrations and also includes some of his own tools that he used to create the iconic images known around the world. Although the Eric Carle exhibit is only on show at the Frist through February, kids and those who are kids at heart always have a place to play and create at the Frist in the Martin Art Quest Gallery. So education and family are at the center of everything we do here. Martin Art Quest Gallery is kind of the, the heart of our institution um, and it's always open um, when we are. So it, it really is a place for families to come and learn about art and engage in hands-on activities. Feeling inspired by the beautiful art at the Frist, I decided that I wanted to create something new, so I headed to ArtQuest to learn how to make an ink print. After getting instructions from one of the instructors there, I began working on my drawing. Okay, we're learning something new. This is it so far. You want to get a nice little view of that? <laughs> Once I etched my drawing into the styrofoam, it was time to ink it and put it through the roller. I feel like I'm driving a ship. <laughs> Voila! art right there. So Thursday and Friday evenings from 5 to 9 p.m. Um, college students, it, it's our college nights and so college students are admitted free uh, with ID. The exhibits are constantly changing which means there will always be something for everyone says Kite. So if you come one time and you're not crazy about what you see, you know, just wait a month, come back and there'll be something completely different. For VNN, I'm Abigail Bowen.